You know, the man he called the dark left his, this life way too soon. Uh, a lot of people figured he was going to have a great NHL career. Drafted 18 overall uh, by the Bruins in a 74 draft. 6'1", 190 right winger. But uh, didn't pan out for him in the NHL, but did well in the WHA. He was a teammate of Wayne Gretzky in Indianapolis. So he had that on his uh, resume. Now, uh, Don Lar Larway, or L Lar L Larway, whatever we want to pronounce it, uh, came to major prominence uh, out of Oak Lake, Manitoba, by playing with Dolphin of the MGHL in Winnipeg of the WCHL. Now, uh, his draft year, he put up beautiful points in Swift Current, 80, 82 and 66 games, including 46 goals. Now, he was rated in the Hockey News draft issue uh, that year as the number 21 overall prospect in the NHL entry draft. The Stingers uh, took him uh, third overall in their draft, and again, Boston went top 20. He was a swift current line mate of his future WHA teammate, the great Terry Ruskowski. Now, he didn't make it to the uh, the NHL, but had a uh, dynamite uh, uh, dynamite uh, career in the WHA. Now, uh, after his uh, after his draft year, he decided to sign with the Houston Arrows of the WHA. Put up 35 points in 76 games in 75, 76 he scored 30 goals. 77, he scored 11, and he had another 24 with Houston in 78. Now, he eventually found his way to Indianapolis Racers in 79, and when he retired from the WHA, he signed with Boston uh, again, but didn't make it uh, to the uh, uh, the big uh, the big club. Now, just to recap a little bit here, again, he signed with Boston January 79 when Indianapolis folded. But he was not offered a contract by Boston following the 79 season and signed with Detroit as an unrestricted free agent uh, in September of 79. Now, again, with Detroit, he played with Kalamazoo and Adirondack. Now, he won an AFCO Cup with Houston in 75. Uh, he played on the regular season champs for use in three straight years from 75 and 77. And he also played 12 games for the Kalamazoo team that won the IHL regular season of playoff titles in 1980, but was not a team uh, with the team during the postseason. Now, he eventually ended up with Houston after Cincinnati traded his rights for Dick Spanbauer in July 74. Now, he scored two goals to help beat St. Louis uh, of the NHL 5-4 in his first exhibition game playing for Houston. Now this was the first time an NHL team had played a WHA squad in an exhibition match. Now he scored a goal in his first WHA game uh, and he was on the infamous kid line with Ruskowski and the great Rich Preston in Houston in 75. He wore number 27 with Houston in honor of his great idol Frank Mahalich. Now unfortunately he missed parts of the 75 season with a broken nose and a foot injury. Now, he also remained in use in the offseason and coached an amateur team there during the summer of 76. Now, his 77 playoff run was cut when he was off with hepatitis and he was also on the Houston team that folded after the 78 season. His rights were sold to Winnipeg in July 78 and then traded to Indy for future considerations on August uh, 10, 78. Now, when he played with Gretzky, that team folded December 15th, 1978, and Dart was one of, again, Gretzky's first professional uh, teammates. And unfortunately, due to unforeseen circumstances, uh, passed away in the Houston area on um, November 9th, 2019, at the young age of 65. So what, a, what an interesting career. Played with Wayne Gretzky, uh, drafted by Boston, a very, very uh, strong player out and off the ice, very dedicated, and again, probably one of the players that helped build hockey in that part of Texas, and for that, we're celebrating him today. So if you like what we're doing here with our podcast, give us a like, comment, and subscribe. Keep your stick in the ice. Bye.